What's going on guys? My name is Atlantis and welcome back to Ramblecraft. Now, I would have done this intro differently. However, <laughs> what I mean by different is I've already done it once and I'm doing it again because I didn't like the first version. However, I only decided that I didn't like it after doing all the work. Now, if you see above my head back there, there's something going on back there and you'll see that in the time lapse of, uh, that I've already recorded. But I did the intro before that and I didn't like it. So, anyway. <laughs> We've got a little cat to name. So above me, you see my cat that is uh, trying to get on the chest or something. <laughs> but I have picked out a name for her. I've decided that this cat is a her. So let's give her, give her, give her fish. Oh, he's so cute. She gets a daily fish just because I, I have fish. I've got, I've got fish to spare. I don't use them. So she gets a fish every day. <laughs> Anyway, there were so many comments for names, and some of them multiple suggested names. Like, same name suggested by different people. So, I looked through all of the comments, and I decided that we're going to name our cat- I hope I have the name tag in my hand. <laughs> we're going to name our cat Mittens! <laughs> I love that name, it's so cute! So yes, there's our cat's name, everyone who suggested Mittens, there you go, you get your name on the cat. <laughs> There were like like three or four people that suggested it <laughs> with some other names of course there were other people that suggested more names as well but i like mittens i like mittens specifically for this kind of cat because a while ago i don't know how how many years it's been since this movie came out but the movie bolt there's a cat in the movie named mittens and it looks just like that so i like i like this name i like this name i love it anyway let's try not to spoil too much of what's going on out here because because oh god uh <laughs> eh there we go <laughs> I got some llamas. Oh god, my horse. I have a horse, but it's over there in the village. Mm. I just woke up today. I just woke up. It's been like half an hour. But it's fine, because I have coffee. <laughs> and a cookie. It's the best kind of cookie. <laughs> anyway, I've already done the timeless for today, and I'll get into that later. But for right now, we've got a prank to pull. Now you see, I wasn't sure what to do for the next part of this episode. So... So, I decided we're gonna go pull a prank. Well, actually, the person we're pulling this prank on decided we're gonna pull a prank because I was asking him what I should do, and he suggested pulling a prank, and he regrets his decision because now he's gonna get pranked. <laughs> anyway, let's let's get going. Now, don't spoil too much of that. Don't, don't spoil it. You guys will see it soon enough. Anyway, um, let's see. I'm gonna need some dark oak. We're gonna need dark oak. Lots of dark oak. Dark oak. Dark oak. Dark oak. There it is. <laughs> There's my dark oak. And this birch that I won't probably be using, but I'll oh, hold on to some of it. There we go. That should do. Anyway, as you can see, I've also got some diamond tools. Now, my project out there that I've been doing was funded by two people. <laughs> Those two people being Chaster and End of Our Chaster gave me... What did he give me? He gave me an efficiency and, un and mending book for my shovel here. And then Endivar gave me a unbreaking book. Well, I paid for it. And he also enchanted the shovel for me, so that's nice. I'm thankful for that. Also, Chaser gave me this pickaxe. Or, yeah, it was this pickaxe. Because I already had an un enchant on it and I just put mending on it. So, thank, thank you guys for that. <laughs> you funded my project, so thank you very much. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have had to go through a ton of, ton of iron or diamond shovels and stuff to get that project done. Anyway, also, down here, I've got... An enchanting room. It's very crude. It's very basic, but we're gonna just not look at it until I have a better one. <laughs> anyway, I need to get going to binary space, so let's get going. Oh yeah, I forgot the person we're pranking is binary vigilante because he suggested it. So when you see this bean, you had this coming. <laughs> anyway, let's get going. Right. So here we are at his base, and with the the boat that he freaking stole from me. Okay. To be fair, I stole one of his boats, so it's fine. What has he got going on in there? You know, I don't know what he's got going on in there. I'm not gonna look in case it spoils it. So, what can we do with this? <laughs> let's see. You know, I haven't put his face on anything in a long time. So let me just make a few, a few things. I'm gonna need some, some of this. <laughs> I'm gonna need some of this. And let's just see what we can do here. Let's see. He's got this thing he's got going on here. Oh, he's got a hole there. Okay, I know I know not to cover that hole. I know what this is, so I know not to know not to cover that up. So let's just go up a few here. And let's bring this across. Just like this. <laughs> let's Ah no, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Let's bring this up like this. And then uh where does that come up at? Right. Right here. One one out one out from this thing. So right here. Let's bring this up again. There we go. <laughs> He's gonna hate me. You see, I have a history of putting faces on things, especially his stuff. So let's just put this here. 
put that there. Let's see how that looks. Haha! -ha. I like that smiley face. There we go. This is the start of our smiley face. <laughs> Let's just stick that. No, not stick that. Unstick. Unstick. We're going to unstick it. Let's just uh, stick some of that right there. There we go. That's looking good. No, it's not. It's not symmetrical. What is what's that symmetrical about it? <laughs> oh no, what have I done? Uh, that side. Okay, I need to break that side. Uh, what? Hold on. Hold on. Wait. I, I think. Okay, I know, what I, I know what I did. I know what I did. I know what I did. <laughs> there we go. Now it's symmetrical, is it? Is it? I think it is. Let me see. Uh, a stair. Block, block, stair, block, block. Yeah, it's symmetrical. At least on the bottom, anyway. <laughs> right, now, we need to make some of these into slabs. I need to make more slabs than that, of course, but, uh, slabs! Slabs, there's the slabs, there we go. And then we actually need some dark oak planks. Let's get that. And then we're gonna need this to be turned into stripped block, so... Oh, God, we should add... We need to add a data pack for that, because that's gonna be annoying. I don't... <laughs> it's such a waste. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Let's climb right back up here. Now I hope he doesn't join while we're doing this, because if he does, that's gonna, <laughs> that's gonna ruin everything. Right, so here's gonna be the eyes of our little face. Let's just strip these, and then we need dark oak. So, I have some dark oak on the side. One, one, two, three, there we go. And then, need eyebrows. <laughs> I don't have a lot of colors to work with, so I'm doing my best, but let's just uh, have these here. Make this one go down. No, down. I said down. Down. Go. No. <laughs> okay, aim for right there. There we go. Hey, I got it. Okay, cool. Ah, ow. No, ah. Mm, that hurt. <laughs> this prank's gonna get me killed, but it's be worth it. Okay, so let's go. Ow. <laughs> Let's see what that looks like. I wish we had, like, wool or something. I don't have enough wool. That looks fine, actually. That looks okay. So let's go do it on the other side. And then we'll add a bit more detail to it. And we'll have have ourselves a prank that's fully finished. And then he'll get some free wood out of this, because I don't want this wood back. <laughs> it's only fair. It's only fair. All right. Let me finish building this stuff up, and we'll see what we've got afterwards. All right, guys. I have finished building our face. It's not the most beautiful face I've ever built, but it'll do for what we have. And I've also left Bean a little message. So for those of you who don't know, Binary's nickname is Bean, and that's what I call him. <laughs> I've left him a little message, and he's also got a bunch of signs around here that he'll have to clean up. It'll be it'll be interesting to see his reaction to this. Anyway, let's get going back onto our base, because we've got work to do. So, speaking of work, the work I've already done, it's going to be a time lapse. So... <laughs> I think, I think now, oh, that looks so majestic. <laughs> I think now is a good time to get started on that time lapse. So, on to the time lapse. Right, so for this time lapse, now, first off, I want to say this video is entirely too short. It's a lot shorter than I was hoping it would be, but eh, a little a short video here and there never killed anybody. But <laughs> also be aware my voice is still, my throat still hurts from the stream I did earlier today, which is on, on the channel if you guys want to go see that. But anyway, for this bit, I didn't really know what to do. <laughs> I didn't have any builds planned or anything like that, so I figured I'd start working on the farming area. And you can see, I'm pillaring up right there because I wasn't quite sure how I wanted to do things. I wasn't quite sure what I wanted to do. I wasn't quite sure how I was going to start building things. I tried to do some paths at first, but it didn't feel quite right, and it felt like it felt a little weird that the water would just meet straight up to the flat ground. I don't know. I didn't. I didn't like that. So I went ahead and built myself a little bit of a cliff. So this terrain took way too long. I spent about six or seven hours working on the terrain all by its just working on the terrain and trying to build it. And during that time I ended up dying a few times and having to have people rescue me and I ended up leaving my base to go get materials that I needed as I mentioned earlier. And yeah it just it took all night. I started at like 11 at p.m. and I finished at around six or seven in the morning. <laughs> so I was tired after this and yeah but it's this is the this is what we've got this is what we've got for this episode and it's I'm happy with this terrain. I'm gonna end up expanding it in later episodes but we'll get we'll get we'll get going. You guys you, you'll see what we've got planned for this. Eventually it's gonna be covered in farmland and everything but anyway this is the start to part of our big project. Now as for our little starter house it's either gonna be destroyed or it's gonna have to be moved up like 10 blocks but I'll probably tear it down and rebuild it on top of where it's at right now. Anyway, 
That's about all I've got for the time lapse. So I'm sorry once again that this video is short. I didn't want it to be only about 15 minutes, but it's it's what it is. It's I didn't have much uh, much to do for this episode, but anyway, hopefully we'll have more next time. I've got a plan for next time, so <laughs> we'll get into that later. But anyway, I'll let you guys enjoy the rest of the music, enjoy the time lapse, and uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy. Right, so I hope you guys enjoyed that time lapse, and I have just been traveling across the ocean since the last recording, and let me just, I'm gonna turn on shaders. My frame rate doesn't like the shaders right now for some reason, but let me just turn on shaders. Probably because of what you're about to see. <laughs> You'll understand why very soon. And by the way, I'm still tired from that time lapse. I spent a good six or seven hours building all of that, and I did it in the middle of the night, so here we go. Anyway, as you can see there, that's the end of our time-lapse bit. So let's have a look around this. It looks so much cooler from the ground than... It looks cool from the air, but it looks cooler from the ground. Look at this! It's so beautiful! I'm so happy with it! I love this! It's just this little cliff into the sea, and eventually this is gonna circle around probably over to like right there, maybe? I don't know. We're gonna, we'll figure it out as we go. But I like how this is looking. And this bit, I left it open because that entire bit there is gonna end up being connected to this. So uh, that's gonna be really cool. Now the reason my frame rate's probably dying is because this thing is a mob farm. <laughs> I haven't lit up any of that, and it's been repairing my shovel and my pickaxe, but I haven't lit it up. Go away, squid. I haven't lit up any of it, <laughs> so that's it's a bit of a mob farm. Anyway, I've got a little thing right there. I'm going to do stuff like that around the entire thing, like maybe one over there, one over there, one, one over over there. <laughs> and this is going to be an entrance to a little docking area. So as I said, this, a this whole area where we've done is going to be the farm area. And the farmers are going to need a little dock that they can maybe like go out fishing or I don't know, like sell their stuff. You know, you get you get the idea. So that's that's going to be like a little carved out entryway into a docking area. I might do it better than that. I might do it differently, but we'll see. And then this circles around here, and we're going to have a circle a little bit up river until we meet up with the wall of the rest of our of our civilization we've got going on here. Now this little house. <laughs> It's gotta go. And by go, I mean raise it like 10 blocks, but you know, I gotta I gotta basically pick up this whole house and put it up higher, so <laughs> that'll be fun to do. Anyway, here's here's the rest of this. Let's head up here. Oh god, this mob's- eh, no, Ow! Go away! Uh, this place is a mob farm, but it's been repairing my tools, so that's nice. Speaking of mob farm, I found, I found a skeleton spawner off in the woods behind my head, so we're gonna have to do that next episode, but... That'll be nice, and I won't have to have this deathly farm anymore. <laughs> but let's see. There's all this over here. It looks so pretty. I'm so happy with it. I love I love this area specifically. I just I like these cliffs. I love I love these sea cliff design. Anyway, let's head over here. Let me see. What is there what else is there to do? I can just show you around up here. It looks very, very empty, like very barren and flat right now, but don't worry, once we're finished with it, it won't. Oh hi, mittens! Coming over to say hi, I see. <laughs> You're so cute! I love you. She likes to like sit sit in my house and such, or you know, on the front deck out there. But I moved her inside the house because I not gonna lie, I was worried about her getting smacked by a skeleton. <laughs> or blown up or something. Well, she wouldn't get blown up. But you know. I was also worried about her me hitting her with my sword and killing her. Anyway, 
I think that's all I've got going for this episode today. So I know that I feel like it was short. I feel like this is a shorter episode than I would like to do, but it'll it'll do. It'll do. We'll have a longer episode next time when I've got more to do and such, when more has been done. But we'll see what happens anyway. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like on the video. If you really enjoyed, be sure to subscribe. The channel is growing so much, and I'm so thankful for that. Thank you guys so much. Oh, look at the sunset. It's beautiful. <laughs> anyway. Let me know what you guys think, and once again... Oh no, you... Who slept? Who ruined my sunset? <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. We'll see you in the next video. Say bye, Mittens. <laughs> yeah, Mittens is gone. Anyway, we'll see you guys next time. Bye! <laughs>